Hi, welcome to the update about uh, Ariola Conchi. We are now at version 1.8.3 and I just wanted to point out that first Conchi Ariola can be run on Arch Linux, on anything Arch really, on anything Debian and on anything Solus. So actually my goal is to run them anywhere. We should have a higher version of Conkey and uh, that's only in Solus uh, difficulty. So if you type Conkey version and you scroll up, you should have a version that says 1.10. The Aureola Conkey is not the same as the Aurora Conkey, which I have abandoned. The Aurora Conkey is a collection of Conkeys that were written in an old code, in the old Conkey code. Starting from 1.10, the Conkey accepts only the Lua code, L-U-A. So if you don't have a Conkey running this version, it will never work. It should be something 1.10, version 1, 2, 3, and so on. So that's important to note. If you do, do not have a 1.10, I point you to the Aurora collection, which is also on erudubois.be. So this one is about the Aureola Conchi and what did change prior to the 1.7? Well, there are no more uh, extra Conchis at the moment, but in the meantime, I'm fine tuning Aureola. So when you install it and you follow the guidelines on erudubois, you, you install it, you'll see that you have this hidden uh, folder in your home directory that has a dot aureola. So you don't see it normally, out of the way, and it has 17 conkeys. So you choose what you like to see that day, and this is Acros, so this is this one here. That's one. Um, first off, when you see me post anything on Google Plus and there have some errors and bugs and, and new additions to the Aureola. I fix those or I edit those. Then you just double click this one. What's this one? Just just goes and gets all the files from the net and it's going to override just this folder. Not the config folder but this folder. So if you change anything here you shouldn't override it and first back up. But as you can see on this icon here, everything has been replaced, goes quite fast, and we are now having the latest of the latest from GitHub. Installing is still the same, you go inside it, ask the terminal to pop up, and then you say install me. The conkey is killed, and now we do, do an override in this file here, in this folder, .config conkey. So everything in here will be overwritten so if you change something because of the hardware of the colors you like now is a good time to back up and put it somewhere else because it's going to be overwritten so are you sure yes i'm sure and there you go everything has been overwritten here as you can see and we have to give him a password and then we close it here and these are all the data that the conkey provides us Okay, what has changed? Well, since um, 1.7, I did, found, uh, did find some bugs as well, so little errors that I fixed even after all this time. And I've made some color coding. As you can see, there are here five color codings. Why? Because I was working on a system, any system, uh, Linux Mint or uh, Arch or Antergos or Solos. I got this wallpaper from Variety and I thought, hmm, it doesn't match, the colors do not match with the wallpaper, so let's change them. And that resulted in uh, combinations with colors that I want to keep. So what if you want to have that too? For instance, we want to try out uh, the gray version. So this is gray and red. Here, here it says gray. How shall we proceed? Well, the thing is, you shouldn't proceed in Aureola. So this is where the base of operations is, this is a collection, but this is the actual conkey. So this is where this little file here is this little conkey. So if you want to change this conkey, you should file, uh, change this file. Now we're going to replace the 
original one with the gray one for instance what we do is I do F2 I name this one original and the gray one I'm gonna call Punky so now this is gonna be the file that's gonna be displayed but not right now first you kill the Konki and then you activate the Konki so this is the gray version of the same Konki it's not more than that it's just another color depending on the wallpaper you can choose to get something else and as you can see we're back on the Linux Mint icon because of the Konki code and the Konki code says go get me a Linux Mint I could tell him to get an Arch PNG and it would be an Arch PNG if only it existed it's called Arch Linux so that's how it works you just replace the name save it and you're on Solus, on Telgos, open box anywhere Arch Linux with an L Eric and then it will work so that's how it works this one is something specific I was working on a laptop and the uh, Acros was too big to be on the little screen so I've made I've adapted the code to uh, laptop so let's go and see what that is so this was conky gray and this is gonna be the conky now and then we go back and say kill all the conkeys and activate the conkey again as you can see it's quite small and it ends down here so for my uh, full HD uh, monitor it's too small but uh, back on the old uh, laptop is just great so do check it out all the rest is coloring here and you'll see that in other systems as well in other um, Aureolas, I believe I made in Skeleton, I've made some color changes, Conky Orange, Conky, so I'll be adding in the future more of these uh, coloring schemes, so you can change whether there's a wallpaper or something else, or another reason, you can change the coloring. So that's um, about it, I guess. If there are issues, do report them on GitHub, there is an... Uh, and a way to report there, a ticketing system to tell me if something goes wrong and then we can fix it. Enjoy Aureola!